coverage you can count on. This is Fox 2 News in the Morning. Good morning. Happy Monday morning. A live look downtown at the Arch. Also, happy winter solstice. The first official day of winter is here. I'll let you know if it's really going to feel like it. Will Parkway School District students be back in the classrooms next semester? The meeting today to decide whether or not to continue virtual learning. The Moderna vaccine is arriving all across the country this week. Which groups in Missouri will get the shots first and the recommendation for the next group after that. And as more area restaurants are forced to close during this pandemic, the one spot where restaurants are able to offer in-person dining and they're seeing a small increase in customers. In a year where everyone goes bowling, one team left at home. TKO coming up. Good morning, everybody. It is Monday, December 21st. Welcome to Fox 2 News at 4 a.m. I'm John Pertzborn. And I'm Kim Hudson. Meteorologist Bridget Mahoney is in for Chris Higgins. Winter officially starts in one minute at 4.02 this morning. Just like Bridget asked, is it going to feel like it? Good morning, Bridget. Right, the countdown is on within the next 60 seconds or so. That is when we officially start the winter season. Now it actually feels a little bit like winter as you're heading out the door this morning, but overall it's not that cold when you compare to where we could be at this time of year. Temperatures still holding on to the 40s in some isolated areas. A lot of us have dropped into the 30s. Union 39, same with Cook Station. 31 degrees in DeSoto, 40 Moscow Mills, same with Salem, as well as Cuba here in St. Louis. Temperatures are starting to drop into the 30s as we see some of the clouds overnight gradually clear out as a lot of them are skirting to the north and the east and they'll continue to clear as we head into this afternoon. So this morning there are some clouds around. We see them clearing as we head through the next several hours, but by around sunrise we could could still see some hang around the area, especially as we look east as that sun is rising. So it actually could be a really beautiful sunrise this morning. Temperatures climbing back into the low 40s around 8 to 9 a.m. 10 a.m. We're already in the mid 40s. Let's bring on the 50s as we head into the first official day of winter. As we head into this evening, of course, we cool off. Uh, again, 56 is our high today to catch the wind. I'll give you a look at that extended forecast coming up in the next 10 minutes. All right, Bridget, welcome aboard. And Jason Maxwell is back. Good morning to you. Yeah, good morning to you, John. Good morning to you, Kim. Guys, let's take you on 64. 64 westbound coming up on Kings Highway. Well, you can see about the live shot right here. The roads are dry. Visibility is good. So if you're heading out this Monday morning, hopefully it's going to translate to a smooth accident-free commute. I'm Jason Maxwell in the Nissan Roadrunner. Let's send it back to you guys. All right, Jason, thank you so much. Well, how will classes be conducted after the holidays? The Parkway School Board will try to answer that question. They are going to meet in a special session tonight. It'll be online, and parents can join the meeting through the district's website. It is tonight at 7 o'clock. The board will discuss how classes will be conducted during the second semester.